European Union is talking about 120,000 refugees, while uh, Secretary Kerry has volunteered to bring in 200,000 uh, unknown uh, ref refugees, but are which are most of them illegal immigrants from the Middle East or Africa. Look, it's not a refugee crisis. It's a refugee invasion. I've seen some reports to say there could be as many as 10, 15 million of them coming. And when you see those pictures, the question I've got is all the pictures are of young men, right, between the ages of 18 and 35. And are young men. Why don't they stay at home and fight for their land? They're leaving their women and children behind. They're, they're coming into Europe for better economic opportunities. What would happen in the United States if we were invaded? Would all the 18, I don't know, go to Canada, go to New do, Zealand? Do they'd we stay wanna, and fight. Do we want to explore that, that question? <laughs> well, hopefully they'd stay and fight. One would hope. And the, and the fact that there is no reason to say, how are we going to vet them? How are we going to explain this to the people? Why we need to bring in 200,000 nameless, faceless, unvetted illegal immigrants, effectively, uh, who are not connected. By the way, most of the reporting shows four-fifths of these people are not from Syria, have nothing to no. do with the war in Syria. So they're what, from North what Africa. is this administration thinking about? Well, they're not thinking about it. They're, ju they're just, well, we got a refugee crisis. It'll be easy. We'll open the well, doors. We we'll let them in. point of fact. Well, we don't. The Europeans do. do. And the problem with it is, as you pointed out, they can't be vet. You cannot vet millions, uh, hundreds of thousands, potentially millions of refugees. They don't walk around with their papers, you know, and their ID information on their on their cards. Well, we don't have, apparently. We don't even know who they are. We don't even have the capacity right now for the 70,000 that we've brought in. That's right. So uh, let, let's turn to... But it's not even talking about the economic part. What are they going to do when they get here? Where are the jobs? We have large unemployment, particularly unskilled unemployment. What are they going to do when they come, whether it's to Europe or the United States? They can't be vetted, so they're a security issue. They're an economic issue. They're a stress on the economies and social services of every one of the countries. I've got to ask you, uh, a, a conversation between Defense Secretary Ash Carter, a counterpart in Russia, uh, they hang up the phone after 50 minutes, and Ash Carter goes out and talks about deconfliction. As, as, at the same time as our intelligence is validating uh, the union of Iran and Russia and its strategy and, and, and military support for Bashar al-Assad's regime, which is absolutely antithetical to the, uh, to the stated goals of this administration. Is this administration ever going to straighten anything out in at least it's its own thinking. No, because I think the president's decided he's leaving the Middle East. Whatever problems are there, it's going to be the next administration's problem. He's got his Iran nuclear deal. He thinks that's his legacy. Enough for him. The problem in the Middle East, though, is, as you point out, and very few people understand what this is, a new alliance, not just that Russia's in the Middle East, but Russia allied with Iran, allied with Syria. What does that control? That controls a lot of the world's exported oil. You control the world's exported oil, you control the world economy. That's it, where this goes. And it may well be that the Europeans are going to take a further lesson in the price of appeasement uh, this winter uh, as they remain dependent upon Russian oil and gas, uh, as well as now the Russians for the security of shipping uh, through, uh, through the Middle East. Mm -hmm. Thanks so much. Thanks, Lou. KTV, great to have you here. Be sure to vote in tonight's poll. Should the pot have stay out of